Hello, my name is Rob Lightfoot, and as the new CEO of NACE, it's my absolute pleasure to introduce you to our conference for this year, which will take place in two venues, uh, one in Reading and one in Bradford, but both um, will take place in November of this year. We'll be looking at how we ensure the needs of more able learners are met, and how we create cognitively challenging learning environments and experiences for all. Um, drawing on the latest evidence, including that of our own publication, Making Space for Able Learners, the one day conference is going to bring together school leaders and practitioners um, to share what's working, explore the science of learning and its applications, and most importantly for you to identify the next steps you need to make to develop embed effective challenge within your own institutions. And the conference itself features dedicated strands for both practitioners and school leaders, and each of those will be broken down into dedicated primary and secondary workshops. I'll now pass over to my colleagues who will also be presenting at the conference to explain those two strands on leaders and practitioners in a little bit more detail. Hello everyone, I'm Chris Shepherd, NACE's Director of Challenge and Curriculum Development, and it gives me great pleasure to tell you about the leadership strand of our upcoming NACE conferences. Now, as Rob has mentioned, this strand of the conference will include keynotes and both primary and secondary phase specific workshops to support you in developing the most effective evidence based leadership approaches to deepen the culture and climate for cognitive challenge and as a result, ensure cognitively challenging schools and classrooms. This strand will also include a focus on curriculum design and organisation to embed cognitive challenge as a key feature of your curriculum intent and implementation in order to meet the needs of more able learners whilst optimising engagement, learning and achievement for all. The phase specific workshops will provide the opportunity to explore, share and develop great leadership practice, including key findings from NACE's research into schools where cognitive challenge is embedded. We will also consider from a leadership perspective, the most effective ways of developing teachers to deliver high quality teaching and learning for the more able. I look forward to seeing you at the conference and sharing great leadership practice in order to improve outcomes for our young people. Hi everybody, I'm Dr Keith Watson, NACE Curriculum Development Director. I'm delighted to be presenting the workshops at our conference this year. In the first session, I'll focus on the role of teacher in developing a cognitively challenging classroom. I'll use practical examples from our Challenge Award schools, and we'll particularly look at pupil independence and how that's developed in the classroom. We'll also look at tasks that have multiple pathways to really encourage challenge in pupil thinking. We want our pupils to think hard. In the second session, we'll build upon those thoughts and we'll look at low threat, high ceiling. As well as this, we'll consider the notion of teaching to the top. Can we actually teach to the top in mixed ability classrooms? We'll also look at the extent to which self-regulation, metacognition and growth mindsets are vital in developing thinking and the right atmosphere in our classrooms for the best learning. The session should be lively, engaging, thought provoking, and it'll be great to see people there. I look forward to seeing you. That just leaves me to wish you all well for the coming year, and we very much look forward to meeting you at one of our conferences. If you have any further questions, then please do not hesitate to get in touch.